In a new fall release 2013, we've added some enhancements for importing digital x-rays. Um, one of the things that you can do is quite simply, of course, you choose the date as normal. And I went back, I'm doing like a last year's set of films. I selected the, at least one of the films that I want to digitize. I'm going to go ahead and do the browse. Um, and one of the things that you'll, you'll now notice is that when we hit search, um, it's going to give us a browser bar so it tells us you know, the progress that it's making. Um, at this point in time, if I wanted to select all the films, I could. Now, in your digital x-ray system, very likely it's not going to be named here. This way there will be a long string of numbers. Um, I manually name those films on the files themselves just because I teach all the time. I wanted to be able to see which files were mine for teaching purposes. Uh, so don't expect yours to have the name over here. Only a couple systems will, uh, digital x-ray vendors will do that. Um, but nonetheless, it will still find the, the correct x-rays. Now, one of the things that we added here is when we go ahead and um, import these films, um, we can go ahead and these are just some random uh, x-rays that we have. Um, but let me go back on, on this one. <clears throat> What's nice is that if we go ahead and we can select the films that we have, I'm going to load this lateral full spine, and um, what we'll do is we're going to go ahead and let me at least load a, a lateral cervical. So here's a lateral cervical. I'm going to go ahead and hit lateral cervical neutral, and you can go through as you, you load these films, um, what we're going to do is it's going to build on what we have. So with that being said, uh, if I wanted to uh, say import this x-ray, just hit lateral lumbar and I'm mapping this and you can easily get a, a staff member to, to do this for you um, and once you have pulled in all the x-rays that you want to we'll go ahead and let's do the lateral let's just go through um, this as well and let's do um, see what the next one is okay we could go ahead and just do this I'll just do lateral cervical extension just so you see how it's building the list that way you never forget what you loaded prior versions you would forget what you actually loaded so this makes it life a lot easier for you uh, that's enough for right now just for demonstration purposes I know I got more films in there so one of the nice new features with this version is that we can go ahead and crop down to the, the sections that we want uh, just like normal but what Posture is going to do is what's new is that it's going to maximize the screen real estate so when you pull in images, if you magnify, it's going to take up the full screen, which is very, very helpful, uh, depending on the screen size. That is new in this new version. Um, and uh, let me just go ahead and, and go through these other films. So I can just go ahead and show you. We'll just go ahead and crop this one down. And we'll go ahead and crop this one down as well, too. Okay and we got a lateral lumbar I'm going to flip it this way I'm going to crop this guy down just a little bit as well and I think we have yeah lumbar extension flip this around I'm just going to keep this one as is and of course I think I loaded the lateral full spine I'm going to go ahead and crop this one down right about like right there perfect so it's really nice having the features where we can go ahead and as we magnify in, it will zoom as we go. So that way we can go ahead and see full screen. On prior versions, you were limited to the window screen size uh, and no longer is that a problem because now you can stay zoomed in and take up your full screen real estate. And this is very, very helpful on small screens. Uh, if you have any other questions, please uh, feel free to watch our other videos of course um, I spend a lot of time on them it really hurts my feelings when you guys don't watch them um, of course I always have a good sense of humor when I talk to you guys but seriously um, hopefully you really enjoy these videos um, it, it's a pleasure working with uh, and recording these videos and and uh, it makes life a lot easier so uh, if you continue liking them and or if there's other videos that you'd like to see just let us know and we'll we'll continue building the help center for you guys all right if you have any other questions, just email us info at postureco, that's postureco.com. Thanks.